Hey gamers, welcome in. It's time to finally start Dragon's Dogma 2. Uh, is this a brand new playthrough, Andy? Yes. Uh, but I only played like an hour's worth on the other playthrough, so I don't really know anything about this game. I got into the first game and Garfield, my NPC, popped up. Uh, and I I refused to have him by my side. It was I'm not proud of him. Conviction is the human will that reach shit I didn't understand the sentence ah <laughs> <laughs> well met <laughs> I don't love that every character is just like from the character creator Pretty much. On a guess, lend me your ears. Long as our favorite man suffered without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Decades have passed since last His Majesty Erland sat atop the Draken throne. Long have we endured, yet it has not been for naught. At last, the bell has tolled on the age of the console. At last, we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. The return of the sovereign. Huzzah! Huzzah! My word, such an inspiring message. Your Majesty shall have my eternal have fealty. Your no Majesty, of how long I have waited this moment. That's fake crowd noise. I piped that in. Behold, before you sits the rightful inheritor of the Draken throne, chosen. And behold the, the new. And enemy. behold the new sweat uh, hoodie at BatchelRifle.com. Fortune has delivered us our savior at last. At last. Praise be, for only the sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the sovereign! All hail! Let all present pledge their allegiance to the sovereign. Let us be united in the hope that our legions reign when they are end. Long live the sovereign of Vermont! Long live the sovereign! Arisen, thou who wouldst slay the dragon, if thou seekest to behold this world in its true aspect, abandon thy reason. Cast aside thine heart and thy life both. Party foul, bro. I dropped my drink. I ask thee I'm so drunk. I'm crazy. Will. We should kiss. Naught but thine ambition can alter the course. Excavation site jail. Or gowl. If you're anybody playing Elden Ring before knowing it was pronounced jail. Was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. Is it you? 
Or how about you with that nice head of hair? You look like you could be the Are one. You the one then? You're a muscular man, aren't you? A large lion and a small kitty. Is it you? No? Mm, it is hard to say. <laughs> this was like, mmm. Mmm. If the pawn I'm looking for does die, it must be you. With the accent, he said pawn, and it sounded like he was saying corn, you know, but the other word. Uh -huh. I, I don't know if I, I could say it in flag you. like YouTube, you know. Are you actually getting 60 frames per second? Yeah, I am. All right, chat. This is what I was telling you. This is what I was telling you. We're about to go buck wild. Are y'all ready for this? To anybody who was here last time, you saw me trying to find the name Cortez. And I was shocked there isn't a Cortez, but... Hey, Pichi Arturo. Hey, Alfonso. How are these names here, bro? There's an Arturo. But not a, like a Cortez. I'm shocked by that. And I think I settled instead of Andy. Or Andrew. Because Andrew's not my name. But that's probably the closest one. I really liked our Texian. Because it just reminds me of like Texas. Like a Texan. So I went with that. I've never heard of Cortez as a first name. Oh no, but those are just like names. Like those aren't even... Those are just like... First and last. There's first and last names in there. It's really weird. Do I have to hit enter? Oh, F to confirm. Gotcha. Proceed with this character. Yes. I ill like that look in your eyes. Tis queerly brazen for a pawn. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap tis only natural seeing as how you rise from the dead. This dude's got- this dude's throwing a lot of mayhaps already. Right off the rip, he's throwing some mayhaps at me. There's aught different about you, though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? Yeah, we hit record again. Mayhaps I hit record. Worry not, Vessel. Three days here, and you'll be longing for death's sweet embrace. I already want that sweet embrace, talking to you. Come along, you feckless dullards. Okay, just call me maidenless, like, while you're at it, right? Pray, do as he says and get in line. Tis for your own good I say this. You do not want to invoke the overseer's wrath. Roth. You know it's like deep, heavy accents when it's not even wrath, it's Roth. When wrath becomes Roth, holy shit, you're in it. <laughs> you're deep in it. Don't look at me that way. I've no need of your pity. Oh, shit, I was just saying what's up, man. What the fuck? It's like maybe maybe we're in this together. Maybe you distract the guards, I peace out. The hole. Get a move on! By the way, Sancho, I'm using my, uh... I'm using my Spurs. The lead controller. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Do you this is no place for one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. 
Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. I didn't want to. I didn't, like... I haven't given you any indication that I want to piss off anybody. I'm supposed to follow you? Yeah, I follow you. Rook's the OG pawn? Oh. I understand how it is they compel us. There is no arisen among the overseers. Okay. Well, let's keep going. I'm off to the tavern. Time for you to get to work. Hmm, yes. Get to work, you rotten layabout. If that's not clear enough. You are okay. prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. Okay, Rook. I mean, with your name, you'd, I'd figure you'd be the one to be doing some of this stuff. God, just so athletic already. Look at me, just doing laps on these fools down here. I didn't... Uh, sorry, lady. I'm too busy moving this rock extremely fast. Sorry. So can I drop this on you? A job well done. Now the next step is to Thank you. What That's is this commotion. Perhaps we ought to investigate. That is so funny. First off, like I don't understand what's happening with this pause menu. This is one of the ugliest things I've ever seen. Um but the first time I experienced that moment because physics systems just kind of always work at random that dude that kind of just like was on the ground like laying down his ass flew off the first time like crazy like his ass like got launched off he was doing flips and shit and there he just kind of didn't do that that was awesome what is the perhaps we ought to investigate well let's just go investigate oh shit It's so busy. The menu looks so incredibly busy. Oh, man. We got a Medusa with some titties. Ay, be what I wait. One look at- uh, one look from her and you'll get rock hard. Thank you. Quick! Give me thy weapons! No! Let me pop off. That's me, bro. I don't care what you say. Mayhaps, dude. Mayhaps I fucking beat this Medusa's ass. I just carve them up. Watch for an opening. Then press your phone till they are over. I These may not carry shields. But then Let's climb her ass. Let's climb this big snake. I wait. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Holy shit. and the like can make effective weapons for the clever combatant. I can just throw shit at her? What am I what am I supposed to throw at her? Like a box or what? A fucking barrel? Eat that shit! <laughs> when delivering cards to the price, I would recommend clinging to your bear. Oh man, this has gotta kill her. She's gotta be super dead so far. Keep climbing, keep climbing. Climb up to the head. Oh, I'm like, am I like poisoned or some shit? Oh, I kind of am. Go 
Don't let her escape, dude. Are you unharmed? You won't see while you can. Ah! Jesus! The fuck are you? <laughs> you cannot linger in this place forever. Ay, no mames, wey. Ay, yo mio. You've lost your memories. It is surely the work of a foul curse, but worry not. You need only believe in your own destiny. This is, this is a destiny character, dude. Like, I'm gonna end up delivering motes of light or some bullshit to this character. I know mom is we sell away. Leaving. Get, back here. Get the fuck out. Go, 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 go. <laughs> this way or is it? Come this way. Let us flee. Sally away. I win! No one could survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn. I know mummy win. Oh, dude, we are riding on the back of this eagle. Hey, good shot, bro. Yeah, you're gonna get it. Keep going. Go now, lost soul. Learn all you can of this world you must protect. The word ought. Like, come on. I'm gonna start using the word ought. Come on. When you start your game with, with credits rolling and the title card, it's the coolest shit of all time, dude. It's just always sick as shit. Michael, therefore you shall give me aught of your nuggets. Damn, what's up, mommy? Oh, damn, dude. I know my way! I can no way! <laughs> Calamite, exactly. I shall deliver the greatest shot. I've ever had. What does the giant say? I forgot what he says exactly. Very good opening. That's so cool. Damn, dude. It's just dead there. I wonder if I could eat it. A truer shot was never loosed. Oh, what the fuck? Great. Keep your distance, Arisen. Hey, dog, get out of here, dude. Some red shit is on me. The grind may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. I don't know about that, bro. You might perish. Known as a Pray, seek it out. 
If you're truly the Arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. I don't know. I, you got a lot of faith in yourself right now, brother. <laughs> like, what? I'm praying for you. Are you all right? What happened here? That's such a Snow White Mike situation there. I, I, I'll be fine, man. I'll be fine, homie. And falls the next. And now you stand before me. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? Shit. Who's asking? It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. The Ultramarine Waterfall. Griffin of all things here. Add to that the recent dragon sighting. Justin, you got this two ends in your name. The of the sovereign portends an age of peace. Yet only trouble has followed. What does it all mean? I'm way too tall. I had thought being in the border watch would make for easy work. But the wind's beginning to blow in a fell direction. My neck is massive too. I may just start a new game. <laughs> I may, I may start a new game after the stream ends. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Batal? Nay, I suppose that's unlikely. We've been estranged from Batal ever since the war. It is difficult to imagine any citizen of Vermont being sent there. Fie! Goblins! Let's take up your weapon, sir. You'll be needing it. I could change my look after. Nice. Where are you going? I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Yeah, like the fighter has the parry, but I also have like this swift step here. And I love that for me. Oh shit, that move is kind of awesome. You can find your strength By the have a bit of green. When one of the fiends comes for you, there are oft items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. If you're not squeamish about picking at their bones, that is. I am not. There should be makeover shops in the main cities. You can also change your pawns look, just not race. Oh, so you can't change to a cat. Is a beast ever more fearsome than a griffin. One need only look to the miserable state of the village of May. Oh my god. This dude just clowned on me. And they're laughing too. <laughs> did that dude just jump at me? Oh, he did. God, this reminds me just so much of fuck you, bitch. Eat shit. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> That's gonna be great. That's gonna be so great. If you jump and grab small enemies, you can pin them to the ground. Oh, that's cool. That's kind of sexy. Hey, real Zombro, thanks for 44 months. When do you think you go back to uh, Rebirth? Uh, I mean, probably this weekend along with Mario Galaxy or Mario Sunshine. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? The pawns. They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? What's up, mummy? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way. You want me to pray, or do you want me to go this way? Like, what, what is it? What do you want me to do? Before you stands a Riftstone.
Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross Ur into this world. Pray, summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you. Thank God it's not going to be Garfield. But guess what? I'm going to have to create the character as well. And YouTube, if you don't want to see this, then you're just going to fast forward because I'm going to leave the recorder going. So get ready for another character creation. Here we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Bada boom. Uh, let's see. I don't really know if the face mattered necessarily, but the head matters. And we went with head number four. I think five. I'm pretty sure it was five. And then I just hit like customize. Let's go. So the head matters immediately. Nope, that wasn't the right head, but it's all good. We have the right head now. And now more importantly, we have the right stats. And this is where we create the love of our life, our guardian, but also maybe our lover, Rebecca Ferguson. Get ready. Get ready for pure art to be created right here. Negative 65 on the face height. Yeah. Negative 65, negative 24. Negative 37. You misspoke, it's Garfield. <laughs> Garfield will never ever see the light of day, okay? Garfield in this game is much like Denis Villeneuve's um like the scenes that get cut from a movie. You're never ever going to see them. They they are they are lost to time. Garfield will Garfield will live and die in your memory and like the next of your kin will never know about Garfield. Those stories will never be passed on. So get used to that immediately. Base head five. Base skin. I went with 11 and then 14. And then 22 and then 15. I didn't put 22, but that's all good. It doesn't got to be super accurate. What does need to be accurate, however, is what makes the face of Rebecca Ferguson. And this is pure science right here. So buckle the hell up. Because I've done peer reviewed research. I brought Rebecca Ferguson into my 3D lab, like scanning lab, similar to Kojima's. And I was able to get uh, accurate scans in. Let me, let me first of all, let me just change the Leon Kennedy hair. I think I'm, I was going with the standard ponytail. Because I don't love a lo whole lot of the hairstyles in this game. Uh, negative 26, negative 9, negative 3. And because this uh, this is like one of those head, um, head shapes where they want things to be like exaggerated with the asymmetric sort of vibe, um, one eye is a lot more closed than the other, which is fine, but Rebecca Ferguson doesn't have that. So we have to make the other eye more closed so that things match. You scroll through the heads on this uh, in this character creator. There's some creatures in here you never ever want to see again. Like everything is so exaggerated. It's like, dude, I've never seen a person that looks like this. <laughs> like this is this is scary shit. 
Three hours in? No, we we stopped to play Valorant because I forgot I had my my Valorant premiere matches, Dylan. And then I had to delete all, scrub all my data so the game didn't save anything over, because I, it's just it was a nightmare. So I'm recreating all of this, but I say I took screenshots of how to create Rebecca Ferguson, and that's what we're about to do right now. That's what we're doing. You're watching in action. 42. So do you want to make your very own Rebecca Ferguson NPC at home? All of these easy 344 steps. It's already getting there. You can already see it, man. Uh, that was nose. These are ears. 19... Zero, 033 and 11 cheeks extremely important because Rebecca Ferguson has the most accentuated cheekbones like it's no wonder why they cast her as Timothy Chalamet's mom because they have like the same cheek and jaw structure Cheek with negative. Did I really put negative 100? I guess I did. Cheek depth, negative 29. Uh, that was cheeks. Now it's on to... Oh shit, I skipped some stuff. Oh dang, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna have to. I skipped some steps, so you're not gonna be able to fully go off, go to school off of this. Oh wait, no, 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 I didn't. I accidentally scrolled up and I didn't mean to. Nose, ears, cheeks, mouth. Yeah, okay, no, we're good. We're good. 568 mouth protrusion 18 because she's got kind of like that look like that she's got kind of like a little like a little like you know she's got her lipstick in that a little bit 34 negative 84 because her upper lip is definitely more protruded Look at that, we're already get, like we're already getting there, man. Like, come on, we are already getting there. And we haven't even hit the jaw and the chin section. And that's where Rebecca Ferguson really comes to life. 752 12 or negative 12. Sixty-seven twenty. I mean, come on, man. That's crazy, dude. Hairstyle seven. What did I do for the hair color set? I did 17 and one. So it was kind of like a dark, I don't know, like a super dark red or something. 26 with high sheen. Eyebrows, we did 14. 18 is the color. And then thickness was 76. Eyes are very important to make Rebecca Ferguson. Three, damn, 309. There's a color 309. I don't know it went down that far. Oh, yeah, that sure is. 309, 295. And 315. And we put iris size negative 18. And pupil size zero. Oh, 
I left it as 15. I didn't even put it as zero. Yo, download. Thank you for six months of support at tier two. We are creating our, our sidekick pawn character. This is Rebecca Ferguson. Having to recreate it from scratch, but luckily I took down everything I needed. All the notes. It's really, it really is like kind of passing on recipes to your children, you know? We did, uh, we did a lot of eyeshadow because we ended up putting like, I put like cool markings above her eyes. On top of her eyes, like with make, with, uh, tattoos or whatever. And it looks kind of sick. She just looks like kind of evil, but mysterious and cool. Uh, eyeliner eight. 70, 75, 40. Freckles. She does have a lot of freckles. That doesn't really change a whole lot. Sometimes you move sliders and like they don't do a damn thing. Cheeks. Oh, I don't have anything in the cheek section. Lips. Do I have anything in the lip section? I do. 23, 80, 46, 54. Body tattoo style. Here we go. So we did 44. 1, 1. We put 50. And then we did uh, something like, damn, that's almost kind of perfect. Holy shit. 68. 68. Go a little bit darker with it. Damn, that's fucking sick. <laughs> this is so sick. It's working out like way better than I could have imagined. Um, and then we put a second tattoo, which is just like another, sh another stripe to go across the eyes to kind of really just nail down the look. And then we made that, uh, 56, 50, and then... Ten. Wait, did I really make it ten one one? That makes no sense. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me, but this one we definitely made a little bit shorter. Yeah. All right, shit, man. That that's that's Rebecca Ferguson, gamers, and she's a mage. She's perfect. I made her calm, and I think I left her at like calm voice three, pretty much. The people here are evacuated and safe yeah, for that's the fine. moment. That's fine. It's definitely not a flattering outfit, but it is what it is, man. You know? We're gonna get her in some cool gear later. Actually, no, I don't want to proceed yet. I want to just make sure that, uh... Rebecca Ferguson's, like... I think she has, like, wider shoulders, maybe. Yeah, that's pretty good. Bam. 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 Oh, 
What's up, mommy? What's up? Dude, let's go. Humans are oft called nomads. We wander between this world and the many other realms with which we are connected. Oh yeah. I am no exception, and my experiences in these other worlds will doubtless be of aid to you on your adventure. It is my privilege to accompany you as your loyal pawn, and I will gladly use the knowledge I gain to guide you. I was promised well, I'll be a pawn summoning before my very eyes. You truly are the Arisen, then. Strange. I thought the Arisen was in the capital. Surely there's only meant to be one Arisen. Fie, this is all beyond my ken. I'm looking for my brother Joshua. The Watchhead would know what to do, I'm sure. Though, as luck would have it, he's away. There's only one dominant of fire. I suppose we'll save any further questions till the Watchhead returns. You're free to do as you like afore then. What? You've no memories, you say? Mayhap you could make for Melv then. It was set upon by Mayhap, the dude. not long ago. Melv? We can go to Melv. The Arisen is said to bear some deep connection to the dragon. Should you be Arisen, mayhap you'll recall aught of import there. Damn, is, is she just like healing us? Thanks, dude. I needed that. Feels better. Mayhap I might. <laughs> like, that'd be me in this world. Mayhap I ought to, to do so. Mayhaps. By touching a rift stone, the Arisen can travel to the bridge, a twixt world, which a great many pawns traverse as they journey beyond the rift. This allows the Arisen to summon pawns who meet their specified preferences. These pawns will not level up while they are accompanying you. However, so you may find that you need to hire new support pawns at regular intervals. Mayhap. Hail, Arisen. Pray, ask all you wish to know. I shall answer, if tis within my power to What listen. up, Graham? Hey, hey, chat. You got an Xbox? Or well, get ready to buy Super Space Club. Tell me of pawns. Nomads, we are oft called. Born in other worlds, we travel here by means of the rift stones that we might aid you, Arisen. However, I cannot speak as to our true nature. Her name is Luke Sadonkic. None of us do. We do not need to. Rift stones are gates that connect this world to a multitude of others. By their power have we crossed into this world. And when our mission is done, by their power shall we return to our own. Tis the name given to fate's chosen. Those destined to command the Pawn Legion. I'm not even looking at her. <laughs> the the yeah, whatever, lady. Even with your memories lost to you, I am afraid you cannot escape your fate. She's nasty in the ISO. <laughs> and mayhap... <laughs> Mayhap you tried to guard me. Sure, I'm as tall as a four, but I play like a point or a shooting guard. Very well. May fortune speed you on your way, Arisen. I'm very ball dominant, however. But I can easily drop 45 on you. On any given night. I'm not that much taller than a lot of the dudes here. Like Lion Man? Look at me. Look at Lion Man. A well-organized pack is my specialty. I'll see to it your burdens are shared between us pawns. Oh, oh, I can hire him here. Actually, what I'm gonna do. Let me go to the Riftstone. Let's see, uh, let's see uh, any other pawns that we might be able to find to join our party. Lion King? <laughs> Hey, princess. Hello there. Oh, your name is just Pawn. Okay. Jillian. Jillian Michaels. We got Chad here. Damn, look at this. 
Look at this Giga Chad with a chin made of steel. Spider, pretty cool name. Inazu Inazuma, that's awesome. Stormy, hello Stormy. Vesemir, that's a cool name. Ronnie, oh my gosh, chat, it's Ronnie. Gail, who just looks very suspicious. I don't, I don't believe your name is Gail. You look really, you look a lot like someone else I fucking know. I've seen, I've seen you before somewhere. You don't quite look like a Gail. <laughs> Zatelia. Damn, what's up, mommy? You're a warrior? That's awesome. I'm way too tall. I gotta, I gotta fix this shit. Hanako. Absolute baddie right here, too. Akira. Nero. Dude, Nero's like 12 feet tall. This dude meant to name... <laughs> this dude wearing a mask, he's like, oh, No, I'm not a tiger. But, but your name sort of looks like the word tiger. Oh, I'm not one, so quit, pretend, quit thinking I am. I just like to wear a mask. <laughs> I think you're a tiger. I think you are one. No. Here's Lara. We got Rika. I'm not hiring anybody yet, but I just wanted to get a lay of the land. You're a tiger. I'm not one. <laughs> Yeah, I was scouting the prospects, exactly. Me and my girlfriend, Rebecca. We're just kind of like, we're not really an item, but we're just, you know. We play fast and loose in these times. Have a gander at my wares. You shan't regret it. I will, I will not shant. I shant not. Don't believe I have anything I can purchase. Modest camping kit. We're poor as shit. Let's be real. Pleasure doing business with you. Not buying. Autosave data cannot be relied upon to save your progress in this world. It is recommended that you rest at ins or regular or at regular intervals if you wish to ensure the re re liability well. of your save data. Better Jesus. To be selective than waste. Hoy there. You seem well tired. Tell you what. You can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect coin from tomorrow, mind. Mayhap I may. Hap, I may. Shant. My pa always used to say, there's naught a good night's sleep can't fix. Not much else I can offer, I'm afraid, but you'll find all sorts at a finer inn. Aye, being armed is better than being defenseless, even if you're untrained. Still, it is worth devoting yourself to a vocation if you can. Opens up new doors, it does. Ah, you should stop yes. by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. They've much more to offer. Don't sell yourself short, dude. Their inn is way nicer than ours. They have they have flat panel televisions. And we still have these big fat ones. We must rest, though the sun is still up. Wait, where are you talking to me from? Rebecca, you're not even in here. Why, why did you, you're in my brain or what? What's up, Becky? Rebecca leveled up too. Make for Melv. What do I have? Again, this is one of the busiest, noisiest looking menus I've ever seen in my life. You gotta blur the shit out of this background if you want this font to really, like, <laughs> look natural on top of it. Do you think there'll be spiders in this game? Oh, yeah. The first game had spiders. Fancy a gander? What are you up to? Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. What are you buying? What are you selling? I don't want a stupid hat. 
We all know how I felt about my other hat. Oh, that's cool, though. I'm going to get it one of those one day. Oh, cool. Dang, I got 900 bucks. So I can buy this cool vest. How about just cooler pants? I, I, I would like cooler pants. Ooh. These work for all sorts of stuff. Oh, but the woodland ones are stronger. I'm gonna buy these pants first. I don't I don't like my legs showing that much, you know. What about for what about for Rebecca Ferguson? Yo, that straight up looks like her. That's crazy. She's like, please don't buy me a stupid hat. I don't want to. I don't want to wear a stupid ass hat, dude. <laughs> don't put me in that stupid hat. Much obliged. My talents lie in combining materials, and I'll use those in my possession to craft things for you in my spare time. Okay, you're being you're being really pushy right now. I got. I'm good. Me. Hey, oh. oh shit. You a soldier? Be a surprise to see you arrive What's up with everybody with two letters at the end of their name? We got Justin with two N's and Phil with two L's? Late, you see. We've had to start sending out new recruits to call them. Is that so? Who went yonder? Lachlan. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Accardo. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. What? Where are well, these reported in You what? I can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fine. I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Say, you seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? It isn't far. Only a short ways out from the main gate. You've my Aye. thanks. Anacardos as well, I'm sure. Aye. You can select the quest to prioritize from among the, those you've accepted. If the quest destination is known, a marker will be placed on your map to indicate it. Furthermore, if you have a pawn in your party who possesses knowledge of that particular quest, they'll be able to guide you to your objective. However, pawns with such knowledge will not offer guidance unless the quest is set as a priority. Some quests are affected by the passage of time and will progress even without the Arisen's involvement. Taking on multiple quests at once be comes with the risk of being unable to act in time, and this can result in unintended consequence. Ooh, try to bear the factor of time in mind when managing your current. I'm never gonna be able to do this. This is an it ADHD person's nightmare. Power to render aid to those in need. Let's just go, Rebecca. To me. Oh, the door just opened. I thought it was like because I'd been playing. <laughs> Dark Arisen, I was used to like a cutscene starting there to take me to the open world. Oi, I see some fuckers up front. There are four commands that the Arisen can use to direct their pawn's companion, their pawn companions. Their effects vary according to the circumstances in which they are used, such as when you are in or out of combat. The best way to get a feel for each command is observe your pawn's response and course of action in various situations. Go! Instructs pawns to act independently of the Arisen. During combat, it directs pawns to spread out across the battlefield. I like go. To me! To fight by my side. Wait. Help. Okay. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our favor. Whoop their ass, Rebecca. Shit, how do I do that move? Oh, I can't do that yet. Ow. Oh, we're healing in here, baby. Oh, they're all dead. Rebecca, you popped off a little too much. You embarrassed me in front of my stream. Holy shit, we just high five. That's awesome. Holy shit. <laughs> Go hire two more pawns. I don't want to right now. I'm cool with just me and Rebecca. I'll get I'll get some more pawns at like the next town. No harm in bringing this along. Ah. 
battle is best avoided. I like the I like this this thief's like dodge, man. Ay, pendejo. Oh shit. Debilitations have negative effects. Ay, pendejo. Oh my god, they're just throwing rocks. Oh shit, we're for who are we fighting with? Hey, who are you? I enjoy tackling fierce foes. Oh, I prefer combat thrills to gathering items. I am confident and may act independently. <laughs> this is what Garfield was telling me earlier. <laughs> He's like, I'm confident and may act independently. And I was like, Garfield, shut up. I don't want you here, dude. Higher zero RC. Oh, that's somebody's. Like, that's somebody's pawn. They got, like, a username and everything. Granted, it's in Chinese, but it's still cool. No, or is that Japanese? That's Japanese. It's still cool, though. But I think I'm... Oh, her name is just Lady. View pawn details. Well, who the fuck is Abby? <laughs> what? View pawn details is Lady. Oh, she belongs to Abby, the person who created Abby. Whoa. Can you show me Rebecca's pawn ID so we could summon her? Yeah, absolutely. How do I do that? Um... Status, maybe? Is it? No, this isn't it. Oh, speak with her. Oh. Hey, Rebecca. Oh, shit, you're just opening treasure? Whoa, cool. Let's talk. Is there all this pawn might do for you? Where ought we to go now? Wait. I have nothing further to add. Ought we not add an archer to our ranks? Oh, she wants an archer. That this, dude, this game is cool. Furthermore, how might I serve you, Arisen? What the fuck? This game is cool. Tabs are in the status screen. Okay. Oh, here we go. There we go. Pawn ID. 9K. KK. 5A. P. V. A. 6. U. F. A. This is so sick. This is so sick, Graham. Already, you know? Just started. What up, Tritty Sant? Dang, I wish I wish I had played this instead of Jagged's Dogma, because I would have been on that review already, like, gushing about this game. A lot of people are like, I can't believe Andy wasn't on the Dragon Zogma thing. It's like, well, I just didn't play it at all. Like, I... I didn't play it at all. Oh, shit. Oh! Oh, my God! Get his ass! How do I get their asses? I don't know how to get their asses. Shit. Rebecca, do some cool shit. Oh my god, she's got a flamethrower. 
Fuck you. Oh my god, they're ladies. I thought they were just birds. Oh my god, that's so scary looking. I thought they were just straight up eagles. Oh. Oh my god, they have like legs and boobs. <laughs> what the fuck is this game? Oh my god, they're freaking out. They're so ugly. They are the ugliest things you ever did see. Like, Rebecca, I'm sorry I'm not more help for you right now. Oh, give me them heals, baby. That was crazy. Hey, who are you? Are you cool, man? Did we kill all of them? I don't think we did. Rebecca's still trying to fight? No, yeah, we killed all of them. <laughs> this is cool. This is cool. Dude, I love this already. Is that all of them? Is that all of them? My name's Ricardo. You have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I... I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to train harder, till I have the confidence to face such beasts on my own. Well, I'd best be heading back, but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. Hey, all right. We'll meet again someday. Putting in the word for me, Chad. He's gonna be like, hey, I know some people. We can maybe get you on your feet. Making our report ought to be our next priority. Where are you? Oh, yeah, I agree. Whatever that means. How's my PC holding up? And can I... I kind of want to make the game a bit sharper. Ew, I've got V-Sync on. Ugh. Ugh. We've got most things on high, I feel like, yeah. I do wish I could make the game more like saturated. Like maybe I can do, I can make it extra saturated in OBS for everybody or some shit. Make it like just, how's that, that look pretty good chat? <laughs> yeah, that looks good. I think it looks fucking great. <laughs> I think it looks awesome. I don't know what y'all are complaining about, honestly. Now it looks like I'm in a... in a flashback. Like, being down here at the standard level of saturation, it looks like I'm in a flashback sequence. Ooh, everything slow motion, you know. Let me bump it up a little bit. Wow, is Andy aging backwards? Looking good, Doc. Damn, look at these compliments. Nah, man, I'm losing my hair slowly. Breaking down. Body's breaking down slowly, but surely. It's good times. Oh, a little cricket. A little grasshopper. Grasshopper stole the show. You saw that, right? Me cracking the... Uh, cranking the saturation to max for Pokemon so I could actually tell some of the shinies apart. It's like, come on. How's the Growlithe shiny looking like that? Ooh. Oh god, there's a boar here. Would fetch a fair sum at ooh, 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 ooh. You just watched me kill your friend like that? Is this on PC? It sure is.
and you know I'm gonna put real big on the thumbnail. Uh, Dragon's Dogma 2, 60 frames per second, PC, high quality gameplay. And look at Rebecca Ferguson. Just looking, looking amazing. So majestic. Hey, Sand Nuggets, chill out. Don't say it. Like, nobody knows about that. Nobody was here. <laughs> nobody was watching. Don't worry about that. We can just do the slow walk. Welcome to the world of Dragon's Dogma 2. Perfect cutscene start. Beautiful. Welcome to Melv. A whole lot of us have been down on our luck recently, but we're hoping for it to turn around real so, soon. This is Melv. The scars left by the dragon's assault are plain to see. Mayhap a walk through the streets would help jog your memory. Yes, mayhap. When the Arisen appears, so too does the dragon. Tis an immutable truth of this world. Hey, what's up? Oh. I've a selection of wares that's sure to please. I just had like my brain just completely interrogated by this outer voice and I just go straight to the shopkeeper. Okay, this guy sells a bunch of arrows. Not now. Hope to see you again. Hope to see you again. Foul tarnished. I've a selection of wares that's sure to please. Are you liking the game, Andy? The podcast made it sound like a lot of you weren't loving it. Well, I know I wasn't a part of the podcast, and I was not a part of the group who wasn't loving it, but. It's definitely, like, it's not a Greg game, um, and I just don't think it was hitting Blessing at the right time. But I'm loving it so far. I'm, I'm really digging it. We just started, but I'm ha having a great time. Hope to see you again. It's been a hard day. Just gonna wave at people politely. Hast thou forgotten thy destiny, thy charge? That is most unfortunate. But it doth not release thee from thy fate. No, you can change weapons. You can, like, it's not ideal because it, like, your permanent stats really, like, really get messed with. But, um, yeah, you can change weapons and stuff like that. Yeah, Tam was telling me when we were hanging out. Shan't be bested. Oh shit. I'm on fire. Oh my god. But well, I don't give a damn. Let me climb this son of a gun. Hey. 
Jack is like, what the hell is that? Oh, so I knew her at one point. Oh, she's definitely going to become my archer. Oh man, I'm burnt to a crisp. My teeth looking beautiful white though. I used that purple toothpaste that Mike got on uh, TikTok. Holy shit. There it is. He just said, damn, this heart looks badass and tasty. I'm gonna eat that shit. We just got some scar lore, y'all. This is so cool. This is unbelievably cool. <laughs> you got that dogma in you. Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. I could never get it to work, Fanny Dragon. Damn, we just found the love of our life. Thank Rebecca goodness. Ferguson, you can join whenever you want. Remember, it's a medieval times. Anything goes. Everybody's the same. This is the second time I've watched over you like this. Isn't it? Second time, you say? You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? That was so fast. Look, life comes at you fast, and so does love. You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. It was terrible. I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. You hung on. Well, it got taken out of some out miracle. Of me. Survived. I seem to have become a risen. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that, though I cannot say I am surprised. Your burns could easily have killed you outright. A great many were bathed in the dragon's flames that day. All perished. Save you. You must be special, indeed. How else could you have survived to return here? La Migra's here, dude. Has he come for you? We are to part so soon, then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. May mayhap. Till then. Take care. Never soon. Oh, yeah, that's gonna look so good, Sphinx. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. I'm glad I found you. The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, 
you will be received with open arms. Why do you doubt me, bro? Oh, but forgive me. I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. Sir Gregor. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Lenart in the chat. Wow. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Hey, Mayhap, Daniel Z. He was having a drink at the inn. Someone must have the answers we seek. If we ask around, we might just find them. Quit walking to Rebecca, please. Don't do that. Thank you. Not that I care a lick either way. It's all the same to me. This is a pretty game. Have you some business with the apothecary, sir? Dreadful sorry if I was in your way. Oh, no. I'm not lost or not, sir. You needn't worry yourself on my account. I'm an apothecary in training, you see. My family runs a little shop in Vernon. Hey, how about you just play with your friends and go out, like... What do you mean in training? You're two years old, young lady. You are a toddler. Fuck work. Put that shit off for like 20 years. See, when I heard tell of a medicine only to be found in this village, I thought I'd come and fetch some for us. Made the journey all by myself as well, if you can believe it. But, well, as luck would have it, I've not enough gold for the you. medicine. It will be a shame to return empty-handed after coming all this way. But what more can I do? <laughs> That's kind of true. With the life expectancy back then. Yeah, you're kind of right. What? You'd do that? You'd get the medicine for me? Suppose there's no harm in that. If you're really sure. Oh, sir. I'd be most grateful. Seems my luck's not as rotten as I thought. I'll wait right here for your return, sir. And many thanks for your kindness. Man, the lip sync isn't even trying. Let's be real. Like, the, the, this procedural lip sync is uh, not great. Combine materials. You can prioritize the inventory. You want materials to be taken first. We could make the fruit rubberant ourselves. Or simply purchase some at Rune's apothecary here in Melv. We can make it. An apple in green makes that? Is that true? Mayhaps that is true. I don't even think that's what I needed. I think I just made some shit. Hello again, sir. Say, no. have you bought got some fruit rubberant for me? Fruit rubberant? Cancel delivery, oh, yes. Well, if you do pick... This might be worth a read. Yeah. That's a good call. Don't stumble around in the dark. Outfit yourself with one of our fine lanterns. Mind how far you stray from home at night. Let space be drawn to the glow at your whip like moths to a flame. Hey, what's up, man? Oh, no? Ah... Well met. Here for some fruit, Roberant, are we? So you need the thing that I could just buy from the place that you are currently interning for? What's up with that? Damn, it's 600 Gs? Shit. What can I sell? Andy, I sent you uh, an important text. I didn't go to Kabuki. It, ended, it it was at Stonestown. And no, I did not see the ghost trap popcorn. 
I did not see the ghost trap popcorn. But mayhaps you find it at another theater. Sir Gregor. Between you and me, guys, they're mighty easy to make. Simple as combining the ingredients, if you know what they are. Yeah, well, I don't, I don't know what, I don't know what they are, but I would love to, I would love to learn. Oh, I thought this, I thought this is a person. <laughs> and what say you? Damn, can I just steal? This is generally used as a material. Oh. Oh, don't be stealing from me. Perhaps that's what I needed. Mayhap it is. Fruit robberant. Nobody mentioned what happened earlier. What happened earlier? Oh, oh yeah. Nobody bring it up. Nobody bring up what happened earlier. About the PC thing. How do I combine this? What do I combine? I'm just ah, going to buy it. Well met. I'm going to sell. I'm going to sell. I want to sell some meat. The beef steak. Yeah, that sounds delicious. And let me buy your fruit robber and fruit press X in your inventory. Do oh, you is that? Oh, use recipe. Oh, wait. No, I know how to combine. I, I just combined, but I don't know what makes this i gotta assume it's the other one with an apple it's gotta be no it makes that salubrious draft as well mayhap it's a harsh spud no it's not i don't have the ingredients oh okay cool 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 well then i'm just gonna buy the dang thing no purchases to be made today, I see. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean... Hey, just sorry. No! Hey! What the fuck? What? Hey! What am I to do? You really ought to have returned by now. It's this guy. Ah, well met. <laughs> what? Come on, man. Come on, dude. That was an accident. I hit a freaking button. I didn't. I just busted up my daggers. You're acting like I pointed them right at you or something. Do come again. You ought not tarry, but deliver what we have retrieved post haste. Hello again, sir. Here's your fruit robberant. for me? Wait, what? Did I not? Oh, I did. Oh, so this is what it looks like. Brilliant. Mm -hmm. Many thanks, sir. You're I welcome. I to offer in return, but I'll be sure to tell Grandfather what you did for us. He'll want to reward you proper like, I'll bet. One could not have hoped for a gladder outcome. We leveled up. Let's go. Ring of Exultation. Is it already on? Oh, equip. Imbue. Ooh, slightly boost maximum health. Im Im put it on my right hand. Thank you. Get you a lantern. Dang, I thought I already had one, but that was in the prologue. Yeah, I gotta get a lantern as well. What am I to do? What, what am I? Hey, here's Leonard's house. Leonard, what's up, dog? Where you at? Oh shit. Shit. All right, I just took some money from Leonard. I guess my bad. Dog. My finger slip. My finger slip. 
Oh, wait, this does not look safe at all. <laughs> this is something that, like, this is something, this is like wire management in on my PC right now. Like, I just, I have fucking power strips just hanging <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> Man, these dudes look shady as fuck. Look at all of them just conspiring. Mayhap this ladder is here for us. Mayhap it is, but first I'm gonna Ace Melina? No, my Melina looked better. Don't even try to compete with my Melina. Damn, what's up, Iris? What's up, mommy? Linus, tech tips. Tavir. Tavir's kind of hot. Dude has a good chin. Great jaw structure. Maggie, a baddie. Hello, Jane. Hello, Maiden. <laughs> they made uh, they made Melina again. There's two Melinas in here, man. Jasmine, Tang Tangeli, Sadie, Main Pawn. Eclipse. Damn, that's a sick ass name. A hey, cat. Slamiroquai. <laughs> it's like Jamiroquai, but it's Slamiroquai. <laughs> of course. Duh. Dude, Ace Ace may be the dude to be like my to be like the, the main tank guy. But I do want an archer for sure. Level seven. Ace is Geralt. Nah, you you missed Geralt earlier, Sphinx. <laughs> I walked by a dude named like Jerry or something, and I was like, I'm pretty sure that's <laughs> you look familiar. Yeah, target flying enemies. Yeah, basically, I do need an archer. What am I to do? Oh, we were already in there. All right, where was this ladder you're talking about, Rebecca? You saw a ladder a little while ago. Oh, is it this one? Drakenward. Oh, I may use Susie's pawn. That's a good call, Gubbo. Fluted bow. Whoa. What the heck? Can I rotate this? Might I be of assistance? Can't really aim left or right. Where is that going? It just disappears. Oh, I, I okay. Let's launch this sucker all the way back. Keep on pulling. Keep on pulling. Ugh. Holy shit. That thing's going for miles. Rebecca, I, I killed somebody out there, right? You saw that? Don't tell anybody. It's between you and I. Between you and I. How did they hit that griffin? It's insane aim. That just... You just know they put the... You just know they put the work in, you know? Constantly practicing. Hail 
The other day, I espied an elf of all things. Seems they've a village nearby. Oh, cool. They ill favor living alongside the people of other races, dwarves in particular. How weird that you can't make an elf or a dwarf. Or, I mean, you can make like a pointy eared, like, person, but you can only make a cat or a human. It's interesting. I guess you can make a super short little stocky elf dude or a dwarf dude. What brings you here? Don't worry about it. It's for me to know for you to find Whoa, I just did a front flip. That was awesome. Oh man. Oh ho! Oh I bet I bet the door worked in this room anyway. But I didn't have to do any of that. <laughs> God damn it. I thought I found some secrets. Damn it. Well, chat, we're going to call it here right now. Thank you so much for hanging out and watching. I can't wait to play the shit out of this all weekend. Unless we get a cutscene that hits immediately. But I shan't think so. I, I reckon you'd be good at this. No, don't try, don't try to patronize me, okay? <gasps> I'm so excited to get lost with Rebecca Ferguson. Let me just face this way. Let's take a little group photo. Because we're, you know, we're we're out in it. We're adventuring. I didn't mean to do that. How do I, like, just move? Can I just move the... I just want to move the camera, actually. Like, how the fuck do I... Why don't I just have a free camera? Guidance display. Okay, I guess I can't. Never mind. All right, this is Dragon's Dogma 2. Appreciate you all hanging out. Thank you so much for the support. If you like this video, make sure you uh, click like, leave a comment for the algorithm. Subscribe if you haven't, and go watch my other bots. I love you gamers.